War of commentaries War of commentaries War of commentaries By Nady 944 Hello everyone and welcome to a new War Commentary And today I have a special guest He is the guy behind the mask um, could you introduce yourself in, in short, Mr. Coyote? Hello everyone, my name is Annex Coyote, and most of you probably know me. If you don't, you should take a look at the forums. But uh, yeah, I'm really excited about this today. Yeah, because we are going to test out the VSS a little bit, and we are also going to talk about it, because it's a big discussion um, on the war community, you know, the forums are full of it, like, why did you release the VSS, what did you do? You know, it's chaos, <laughs> it's, it's apocalypse. So uh, yeah, yeah. What is your opinion about VSS? Um, I believe that in the in its current state, it's 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 a really good weapon for the eighth slot. I mean, the magazine size is about right, and um, yeah, I really don't think it's too overpowered. I know that people disagree with me on that, but you know, they're there. <laughs> yeah, we are playing one first one, and uh, it was kind of funny because yeah, <laughs> this is the best enemy ever, you know. You know, I, I I tell you I tell you this this weapon is, is is not overpowered and you shoot me in the face with it. That's really great. Yeah, the only problem with this weapon is that uh, the accuracy is really bad. So basically, yeah, if I'm on a distance, then it's not really nice. But if I see this weapon in game right now, everyone is using it as a machine gun. It's not a sniper gun or something. This this could also be a weapon for the soul or something. You know. I guess I guess you could you could say that I could see that with a bigger magazine, um, maybe. But yeah. But, but do you have any plans regarding, like, do you want to uh, make the VSS a little bit less good, or do you want to keep it like this, or...? Um, actually, we're not we're not thinking of, of nerfing it right now, also because we just put it out, and I think it's really important to, to see the long-term effects so far. We do have people who complain, but you do have a lot of people who... that oh, Ooh, ouch. You do have a lot of people who, who do, you know, exaggerate a little. I, I read a lot of things like, oh, every second player has this weapon, and that's what makes it so bad. But yeah. um, that's quite clearly not the case. I, I just cheated, by the way. I shot you with the wrong weapon. I know. I know. <laughs> It kind of sucks, but yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. I know that some people disagree with this choice, but I really, I really think it's 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 quite nice nice to have it back in the whole oh, man in the version that that we have it now. And <laughs> apparently, you're really good with this thing. Well, everyone is good with this. Oh thing, come actually. on! <laughs> Serious, you can't lie about that. That's true. Like you are even good with this thing. <laughs> oh, what a low blow! I think that most people who are not buying it are just saying like. Yeah, it's kind of no skill, you know, and uh, I want to keep making kills with, like, yeah, a weapon that is harder to, to aim with or hard to kill with. But I think then you are a little bit more skilled. That just has to do with uh, how good you are in-game or how good you want to be in-game. Well, you know? uh, sure, I mean, it's, it's totally fair to say, oh, you know, I want to... I only play with pistols <laughs> because it makes it harder <laughs> okay. for me. Okay, that's know. Uh, interesting. Um, I think that's fair to say if you want to do that. But uh, I also think that I really don't think this weapon turns you into some, you know, no skill guy. Um, it's just. And why? Why do you think that? Or why? I, I, I think so because. Um, you know, like we like we established, especially uh, long distance, it does require. Wow, not bad. It does require <laughs> quite a lot of skill. So um, short distance, sure. But honestly, in real life, if I stand in front of you with a sniper rifle, I'm probably gonna kill you instantly as well. So, you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. So basically, if you don't, if you can't defeat this weapon with your favorite weapon, then maybe you have to step up your game. <laughs> yeah, maybe, maybe. Because, I mean, it's not like it has an aimbot implemented or anything like that. Yeah, okay, but some weapons, but this one has it as well, that every weapon, some weapons are really good, but always have one thing that is really bad about it. Right. And that's that's the accuracy right now with the zoom, you know. And Exactly. But yeah. it's, it's not a problem in close quarters combat, you know, to have that. No, because no. Because you are not really aiming there. If you are playing a deathmatch map, then it's really close and you can just no scope. So then the weapon is really irritating against every gun you have. Because this this is serious, this is the best weapon you can get in Warrock right now. Uh. Let's let's do let's do it different. Let's do it like the Wild West, you know? <laughs> I'm going to stand here and you as well. And then I then I uh, count to three or one, and then uh, I turn around, and then and then we try to okay, kill each other. Okay, okay, that okay? sounds good. I'm I'm, I'm right okay. behind you actually. Okay, wait. I, I turn around because I I think we should turn around. Okay, okay. That, that's harder, I think. Okay. <laughs> uh, okay. So then I I count from three, and then one you can just 
uh, turn around, you know? Okay, okay. Okay, let's do this. Three, two, one. <laughs> oh. yeah, this is really something you 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 already killed me a few times and I, that was kind of stupid for me you know and, oh and, God, and you are close I know and I'm a terrible sniper <laughs> but um <laughs> no I, I I totally uh, get what you're saying oh ouch uh, what you're saying about the uh, um, the whole thing with you know you building your reputation by playing with a certain weapon but I also think maybe I'm a little bit sentimental there but I also think you kind of build a, a relationship with that weapon you know you, you have a feeling for how it handles and that's that's really important too. So I, you know, with some games I played in the past, I really I only played with one or two weapons, just because I, I really I really knew how they handled and I knew the damage, I knew the recoil, and uh, sure. But but did you did you try it out VSS in battle group as well and in zombie mode? Yes, uh, actually no, actually in zombie mode. To be fair, I, I didn't try it for long. I just tried a little bit. Um, I think you should really be able to kill an end boss with it. If it's I don't know if the damage is the same because. Uh, sometimes you have a famas, you are not really killing an end boss with that, but they have more, much more HP, you know, than a yeah, normal yeah. player has. Battle group is, is really, I tried it on, on, on zero point, and yes. <laughs> that didn't go over well for me. I mean, seriously. That, that's your that's your favorite map, right? I love it. <laughs> zero point is my favorite battle group map because it's the first map we patched after I started working on Warhawk. And uh, so I kind of got used to it, you know, I did so much testing on it and, and, and all that, so I, I kind of, I'm a little bit sentimental about it. I failed because this weapon is amazing, unless you try to use it on a really long distance, as we've said, and that's what I tried to do, and it was not a good idea. That's how I learned about the limits of the VSS. So yeah, this was the video, and uh, it was really fun to play with you. You're already gone, by the way, maybe you are raging right now, because I own Yeah, you. rage quit. Yeah, indeed. <laughs> so yeah, it was kind of fun, and I would really like to know what you guys think about VSS, um, and then maybe Mr. Coyote himself can check out your comments about it, you know? So. Um, that's what I would really like to hear from you guys. And if you want, you can like this video, you can comment as I said before. And you can also subscribe if you didn't do that already. So uh, thank you for joining my commentary. And uh, yeah, that's it. And uh, as I always say, and I see you guys next time.